scorpions live in our surroundings and getting stung by a scorpion is a possibility. The scorpion sting is in its tail. Some of them are very venomous. Today, we will see how to provide first aid in case of a scorpion sting. Several types of scorpions are found in India. A majority of them are mildly venomous and their sting is not very dangerous. But some scorpions are highly venomous. These can be identified by their thick and powerful tails and underdeveloped pincers. Their venom may cause death without timely and proper treatment. It is difficult for a layperson to identify the type of scorpion and whether it is highly venomous. That is why scorpion stings should be treated like an emergency and the patient must be taken to a doctor. Symptoms following a scorpion sting depend on the species of the scorpion and also on the age and general health of the person. Different individuals show different reactions to a scorpion sting. Here are the common reactions. Burning, pain and tingling at the sting site. The pain can be excruciating. Swelling at the sting site. Wash the sting site well with soap and water for immediate relief. Apply a cold compress on the affected area. You can also apply a cold pack using ice wrapped in a cloth. Never apply ice directly on the skin. Take the patient to the nearest hospital or a doctor for treatment. Remember, if the person has suffered a venomous sting, then it may be a medical emergency. Sting of a venomous scorpion may have some grave symptoms. Sweating, excessive salivation, hands and feet turning cold, restlessness and dizziness, trouble in breathing, tightness or cramping of muscles. In case of any of the symptoms mentioned, rush the patient to a hospital without wasting any time. Immediate medical attention is necessary. Call 108 or 112 for an ambulance. If the ambulance is delayed for any reason, do not waste any time. Rush the patient to the nearest hospital. Support the sting site and keep it below the level of the heart to slow down the spread of venom. Avoid moving the affected part. Do not bandage the area or tie a tight tourniquet. This is not only unnecessary, but it can also be harmful. Always treat scorpion sting seriously and take the patient to the doctor immediately. Remember, scorpion venom poses a greater risk to children and the elderly. Seek immediate medical attention without wasting any time. Prevention is better than cure. Let us learn how we can protect ourselves from a scorpion sting. Always be vigilant and careful. Do not carelessly put your hand into dark corners or under rocks and stones. Always check for the presence of scorpions. Most scorpions are nocturnal. Use a torch and be careful after sundown. If scorpions are commonly found in your area, shake out your clothes before wearing them. Shake out your shoes and check for scorpions before putting your feet into them. Scorpions do not sting us deliberately. They sting only when they feel threatened. If a scorpion lands on you by any chance, never try to swat it. Flick it away from your body like this, so that it falls at a distance. Our safety is in our own hands. Remember, the anti-venom for treating scorpion sting is available in our country. It is essential to get the proper treatment immediately. 
Now, let us relook at first aid for scorpion sting one more time. Keep the patient calm and reassured. Check the condition of the patient. Wash the sting site well with soap and water. Apply a cold compress with cold water or ice wrapped in cloth for pain relief. Keep the sting site immobilized and below heart level. Treat a scorpion sting as a serious medical emergency and go to the hospital at the earliest. Time for your task. Apart from scorpions, what other crawling insects or creatures found in your surroundings bite or sting? Ask doctors, elders or experts for advice. What should you do if you get stung or bitten by any of them? What can you do to stay safe and prevent being stung? Learn first aid. Stay alert. Stay safe.